Okay. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. We'll start now doing the exercises from the book uh, related to this section 5.5. What he said. Find the particular solution. Okay. Yeah. This is we can do the. What do you call it? Uh, Add the term coefficients. So let me do it. Yeah, let me make it like steps. Huh? First step, I will do the homogeneous. My double prime minus nine y equals zero. I solve this. I have r squared minus nine equals zero. So I have r equal plus or minus three. Very clear. So it is yc. I need yc. I need the roots. C1 e to the power three x. Plus C2 e to the power minus 3x. Second step, find the roots from here. Roots from, uh, let me say, from right hand side. I'm doing it backward, huh? We know that. Minus 5. <coughs> so I have now new list. Actually, there is no intersection, so there is no duplication. But just to make it as a procedure, we have new list of roots, which is minus five, minus three, three. And I'll find yp hat, which is what? C1, e minus five x, plus C2, e minus three x, plus C3, e three x. Now we'll find YP by cancelling YC. So this is cancelled and this is cancelled. So it is YP A E minus 5X. Nice. So it is YP prime. I need to find A now. How to find A? I substitute it into one. So I need Y prime and Y double prime. I need Y and Y double prime. So I need Y double prime. Okay. That will be minus 5a, e minus 5x, yb double prime. That will be 25a, e minus 5x. And let's substitute this in one. Okay, so step five, I substitute in one. I get what? 25a is minus 5x. Yeah. Multiply this is by one, this is by zero, this is by minus nine, minus nine a. A minus five x. That equal to the right hand side, which is e is minus five x. <laughs> so I'm getting sixteen a. So it means sixteen a equal one. So a equal one over sixteen. What is y y p? One over one over sixteen. This is y p. I just plug the a. Yeah, that will be my answer. Okay. Next one. Solve this one. To find y p. Okay. We'll do it the same steps, huh? First, we solve the homogeneous. Equal zero. So you have four R square plus four R plus one, which is two R plus one square equal zero. So R will be minus half and minus half. So why C? C one x minus half. The roots from right hand side. That means what? I need one, one. One and one since I have times x. A to the power x means if I go backward to the equation, to the differential equation, I have the root one and it's repeated. 
Okay, two times. Okay. This is step two. Step three, I have new list now. By the way, there is no intersection, no duplication. So I need this, but just for completion. I don't do it the same step. So minus half, minus half. What one? What is YB hat? YB hat is third step, yes. That will be C1, E minus half X. Let's say 2x is minus half x plus c3 e to the power x plus c4 x e to the power x. I cancel yc to find yb. Cancel this, cancel this. So it is yb is a e to the power x plus bx e to the power x. Now we need to find a and b. Okay. I need to solve this, so I need y double prime. So I need y prime, a x. Have product of two functions here. Be careful. B e to the power x plus b x e to the power x. Y b double prime. We have a e to the power x plus b e to the power x plus b e to the power x plus b x e to the power x. I need to multiply this by 4, this is by 4, this is by 1. So let's substitute this in 1. Substitute in 1, and this is 1. What you will get? I need 4y double prime plus 4yp prime plus yp. This is the left hand side, that would be equal, but 4a. E to the power x. I have 2b, so it's plus 8b e to the power x plus 4bx e to the power x. This is plus 4. a e to the power x plus 4b e to the power x plus 4 b x e to the power x plus a e to the power x plus b x e to the power x. All of that equal 3x e to the power x. So I need the coefficient of e to the power x. Yeah, be careful. I have what? 4a, 8b, 4a again, 4b, and 1a. So I have nine A, okay, and B I have what? Twelve B, and that should equal what? I don't have E to the power X here. That would be equal to zero. This is my first equation. <clears throat> my second equation, I have four B times X E to the power X, four B and one B. So I have nine B. And that should equal to three. So B equal one over three. Plug it here. So I have nine A plus four equals zero. So A will be equal minus four over nine. A equal minus four over nine. So it is YP. This is YP, just plug the A and the B. So I have minus four over 9 e to the power x plus 1 over 3 x e to the power x, which is the correct answer. Okay. <coughs> Need to solve this. Five. Yeah, be careful here. This is sine square x. I don't have. Hmm, we cannot do sine square x. Unless I do a trick. I know that cosine 2x is 1 minus 2 sine square. That will help me to do this, to do this one. So I have what? 2 sine square is 1 minus cosine 2x. So sine square 
on behalf of my last So this is actually is half minus half cosine times, which I can do now. Using and the term conditions. <coughs> Okay, so first I solve the homogeneous. Not easy to solve, not easy, just I need to. What will be the auxiliary equation? It's R squared plus R plus one equals zero. So you have R equal. Minus B, B1 minus 4AC over 2. So R equal what? Minus 1 over 2 plus S minus square 3 over 2I. So it is YC. It will be C1. I don't need it. Yeah. Yeah. What are now second step? Roads from right hand side. It will be what? Zero. This is for the half. And this one I have plus or minus two i. <coughs> you know what? I don't need the third step in this case. Why? Because I don't have duplication. This. If you look at this and this one, there is no duplication. So I can go to step four, I can write YP just using this. That will be A plus B cosine to X plus C sine to X. Yeah, if I do y, YB hat, then I need to cancel YC. I go back to what I have. Okay. So sometimes you can't do this. Now we need to substitute it back to find A and B. So find YB prime. That will be minus 2B sine to X plus 2C cosine to X. So what is YB double prime? That is minus 4B cosine to X minus 4C sine to X. I multiply this is one one one. <coughs> so I need to substitute in one. This is one. So I have what? Minus four b cosine to x minus four c sine to x minus two b sine to x plus two c cosine to x plus a plus b cosine to x plus c sine to x that would be equal to half minus half cosine to x so i need the coefficient of what i need the coefficient of the constant which is easy i have only a here that would be a and from the other side i have half and then the coefficient of cosine to x that will be what? I have minus 4b minus uh, plus 2c plus b. So I have 2c minus 3b. So I have minus 3b plus 2c, and that should be equal to minus half, since I have minus half here. For sine to x, what I have? I have minus 4c plus c minus 3c minus 2b. So I have minus 2b minus 3c, and that should be equal to 0. Mm -hmm. Now I need to solve for b and c. I need to solve for b and c. Yeah. I need to solve for this. Solve these two equations. This is going to help us. So multiply the first by minus two and the second by three so i have six b 
minus 4c equal to 1. I multiply the first by minus 2 and the second by 3. You make it the same. You do it the way you like. Minus 6b minus 9c equals 0. So I have add them. I have minus 13c equal 1. So you have c equal minus 1 over 13. Plug it in in one of these equations. I have the first one minus 3b minus 2 over 13. I plug it in this one. Is equal to minus half, or you know what? Let me plug it in the second one, maybe better. I don't have fractions. I have minus 2b plus 3 over 13 equals 0. So b will be equal what? 3 over 26. 3 over 26. <coughs> so what is yb? yb will be a, which is half. Is it yb plus b 3 over 26 cosine to x minus 1 over 13 sine to x? Yes. Good. Okay. Do more problems. Okay. Now we'll do what? Yeah. The same step. First, we solve the homogeneous. So I have what r square minus 4 equals 0. So r equals plus or minus 2. Okay. So yc is c1 e to the power minus 2x plus c2 e to the power 2x. I have cosine hyperbolic the other side. There is no rule for cosine hyperbolic. Hmm. Yeah, but this is we can't find we can't think of it. What's cosine hyperbolic? It's half e to x plus half e minus x. Now I can work it out. So what will be the root from right hand side? There will be minus two and two. I have the application now. So I need to do this third step. What is the new list? New list of roads. Combine them. Minus two, minus two, two, two. Maybe hat. C1. E to the power minus two x. Plus C2 x minus two x. Plus C3 e to x. Plus C4 x e to the power two x. Okay, for the step, I need to find yb by cancelling yc. So I cancel this, I cancel this. So I have a x a minus 2x plus b x e to the power 2 x. Okay, now I need to solve to find a and b. I need y double prime, so I need to do it. yb prime, that will be what? Product of two functions. I have a. And what is this? A is minus two x minus two a x is minus two x plus b e to the power two x plus two b x e to the power two x. Yb double prime, that will be minus 2a is minus 2x. Yeah, be careful. Minus 2a is minus 2x plus 4a x is minus 2x plus 2b e to the power 2x plus 2b e to the power 2x plus 4b x e to the power 2x. Now I need Substitute this in one. That is one. So that give me what? This is the fifth step. You need to be careful. This is one, this is zero, this is four, minus. Yeah. 
So you have what here? I have minus 4a is minus 2x plus 4a e to the x e to the power minus 2x plus 4b e to the power mm -hmm. 2x plus 4bx e to the power 2x minus 4. This is minus 4. ax e to the power minus 2x minus 4bx e to the power 2x. And that should equal to half e to the power 2x plus half e to the power minus 2x. Be careful here. This is cancelled and this one cancelled. That will make our life easy. Okay. So now I need to find the A's and B's. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Five. Five equates. Okay. So this is the fifth step, actually, and that will be the sixth step. Okay. So this is now my fifth step. Okay. I equate, I have e is minus 2x. I have what? Only minus 4a. That's it. And that should equal to half. So I have a is minus 1 over 8. That will be a. Okay. I have e to the power 2x. I have only this. So I have 4b equal half. So B equal 1 over 8. Last step, what is YP? I just retain A and B. I have A is minus 1 over 8. X is minus 2X plus 1 over 8. X is to the power 2X. That will be my solution. And it is the solution. Okay. Yeah. This one. Yeah, we have what? First, we solve the homogeneous. So I'm getting what? R squared plus 9 equals 0. So I have R equal plus or minus 3i. So I see. Cosine 3x. Sign 3x. Second step, roots from right hand side. I have 2 cosine 3x plus 3 sine 2x. So I would add the roots, only plus or minus 3i. Because that will bring both cosine and sine. Okay. Now I solve for uh, new list. Because there is, there is a duplication. So I have plus or minus 3i, plus or minus 3i. So it is yb hat, c1 cosine 3x, plus c2 sine 3x, plus c3x cosine 3x, plus c plus x sine 3x. What is yb? I cancel this, since it's in yc, and I have a, x cosine 3x yeah plus b x sine 3x i need y b y prime and y double prime be careful i have a cosine 3x <coughs> minus a minus 3a x cosine 3x yeah plus b sine 2x plus b sine 3x plus 3b x cosine 3x yb double prime 
So let's not go sign. Is this sign? That will be minus 3a side 3x minus 3a side 3x minus 9a x cosine 3x plus 3ab side 3x plus 3b plus 3b cosine 3x sorry this is cosine 3b cosine 3x minus 9b x sine 3x. Okay, so I need this is 1, this is 0, this is 9. Okay, so I'll substitute in 1. Huh? Substitute in 1. And this is my 1. Let us see what will happen. I have what minus six a sine three x. Here I have what this is three, huh? I have minus nine a x cosine three x plus six b cosine three x minus nine b x sine 3x this is plus 9 here plus 9 a x cosine 3x plus 9 b x sine 3x if you look at it this is easy this cancelled this one cancel with this this one cancel with this yeah and that should equal to what? 2 cosine 3x plus 3 sine 3x. Okay. So I equate sine 3x, what I have on this side, minus 6a. And the other side, I have what? 2. So a will be minus 1 over 3 cosine 3x, what I have here, I have only 6b, and that should equal, no, sorry, minus 6a with sine, so that will be 3, sorry, that will be minus half. Cosine 3x is 6b, this side, the other side it is 2, so b equal 1 over 3. Okay. So what is my what is my YP? Only plug A and B. I have minus half x cosine three x plus one over three x sine three x. 